guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a Killstar haul, but also mixed in will be some other random purchases slash things I have gotten as gifts, kind of. Uh, just, just stuff that I've gotten over the last couple months or whatever that I haven't made a YouTube video about, but I've probably posted on my Instagram, so yeah, um, but this just kind of compiles everything that might be kind of interesting slash in the Killstar like aesthetic anyways. So I'm just going to throw it all into the same video. Um, so yeah, I just have on uh, kind of an outfit that I wanted to show you guys before I get into the actual Killstar part of the video. So I'm sure you guys have seen this hoodie uh, all over the internet. I know that I used to see it like everywhere for a while. So it's just this um, hoodie that has a moon. It has some cool symbols that my mom does not like uh, on the arms and everything. And then it has this super duper uh, big 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 hood that literally you could cover your whole entire face if you wanted to but it's a very like witchcraft uh, it literally says witchcraft on it um type hoodie um i got the cheap version off of ebay like the knockoff i don't even know what website sells it usually but it was only like 12 dollars and i think i got it in a medium and i kind of wish i got it in like a large because i like my hoodies to be like bigger um and this fits to me kind of like how a small would but it's still super cool. Um, I love it. But I did, I got these a few months ago, these leggings, and they are ones that lace all the way up from the bottom, all the way up to the top, like past where your uh, underwear would go. So they are quite risky, um, but I like them. And I had a lot of people ask me where I got them, and I think Dolls Kill is where a lot of people thought that I got them from, but I actually got them from Forever 21 a few months ago, so I don't know if you can get them anymore, but... Yeah, I think that they were like $30 or something, and I freaking love them. They are super, like, stretchy and comfortable, and they fit really well. I've had um, lace-up leggings before, and I find that they, like, hurt my legs. Like, the lace, like, cuts into me, but these ones are pretty comfortable, so I like them a lot. Um, also, I'm engaged now, in case you didn't hear from on my Instagram. Basically, I'm going to make a separate video, but... So, basically, to sum it up, I met someone on World of Warcraft and I went and met them for the first time like two weekends ago and he asked me to marry him and I said yes so I'm engaged now ah um, but yeah I'll make that into a separate video but yeah anyways I'm just gonna go ahead and start with the Killstar portion of the haul and then I will uh, jump into the other stuff that I've gotten recently okay so I am hot so I took my sweater off um, I'm gonna start with like the big Killstar thing that I got. Um, so as I was saying, uh, I'm engaged now and I obviously had to go visit my partner to uh, get to that point. So of course, if I was going to be traveling, I had to get the Killstar coffin luggage. Um, this thing is amazing. I did not own any luggage, suitcase stuff um, before this, so I really needed something and this was clearly what I needed to have. Um, this is freaking amazing. It is like carry-on size and it's like a hard case kind of deal and I was able to fit everything I needed for like a five-day weekend into here so that was freaking perfect. I felt like a badass going through the airport with this. I don't know if you guys can see it very well but let me tell you I felt freaking cool. I felt like everyone was staring at me but it was well worth it. I really dig it. Um, so I will try to put in some footage of like up close and stuff of this too. Here it is, uh, just like this. It's kind of dirty on the bottom because I was using it uh, through the snow and stuff. Um, yep. Aside from the suitcase, I bought three articles of clothing. Um, this one was a clear out knit uh, sweater, which I've never bought a knit sweater and I don't typically wear knit sweaters anyways, but um, I saw um, like an outfit preview with one of the pairs of leggings that I bought and the model was wearing the leggings with like a big sweater. Uh, this wasn't the exact one that she was wearing with it but it was as close as I could get because um, the one that she was wearing was sold out of my size so this is super cute. I really love it. The only issue I have is it comes down like super low so you have to like wear something underneath of it unless you want your tits out uh, which I don't so yeah I will try that on at the end after I show you guys everything else. The next item I got is this really cute uh, lacy kind of frilly top and it has these little ties to do up like a bow around your neck and this was like super not my usual taste like this was a little bit out of my comfort zone but 
So I was kind of nervous getting it. I was like, oh, I don't know if I'm actually going to wear it. But I actually freaking love it so much. Um, I usually just wear it with like a black bra underneath. Um, and it looks super cute. It has like amazing uh, patterns and stuff on it with like stars and like kind of scrolly uh, stuff. And it's super duper cute. I uh, really, really love this. I kind of bought this as like a cute thing to wear when I went to go meet my boyfriend because... I don't know, he always talks about how I'm his like goth GF and I feel like I'm not really like up to full goth standards so I was like I'm going to try a little bit harder. The last thing I got from Killstar is these black leggings, um, they are high waisted which is my favorite um, and they have this awesome fishnet uh, fit on the thighs here with these um, pentagrams as well and they are very high quality and they look so amazing on. So this is what I saw the model wearing with a knit sweater and it looks so cool. So I freaking love them and leggings are just my favorite. Like I'm not a big like jeans person because I just find why would you want to wear jeans when you can wear stretchy comfortable leggings. So it's nice to have leggings that are like kind of fancier by like having more like stuff to them than just being plain leggings. So these are amazing. I wish I could wear these every day. So this is the first uh, Killstar thing that I'm showing you. It's the lace frilly uh, top that ties up with a little bow here. Um, it would probably look better without a choker, but I don't care. I'm going to keep it there. So yeah, it's super cute. Um, every time I put it on, I feel like very like Victorian goth or something. And it's like I said, it's a little bit weird for me, but I think... I think it looks good. Let me let me know what you guys think. I do still feel a little bit weird because I'm not used to wearing like fancy stuff. Um, it makes me a little bit uncomfortable because I'm a gamer so it's like I just like to be in like chill clothing most of the time but I think it's super cute. I really really like the shoulders. They're amazing um, and I like this little bit with the elastic and then it kind of like flares out a bit and it's like short like it's kind of cropped but not like a crop top but you know it's like it's just very, very cute. I really, really like it. And, um, here it is with my hair back, just so you can kind of get a better idea of what the front looks like and everything. Um, my hair extensions probably look really disgusting from the back uh, and not blended, but whatever, just to give you guys an idea of what that looks like. So the next thing I'm going to show you guys is the Killstar leggings. So I angled my camera. Uh, down so you can actually take a better look at them. I freaking love these so much. Um, they're super comfortable like I was saying. Uh, the only issue I have is that, um, so these are an extra small because I'm a very tiny person but my thighs are pretty thick for how tiny I am so I kind of have a hard time like getting them like up on my thighs because this area with um, the pentagram and the fish netting is kind of tight so it's a little bit like uh, just tight to put on but other than that I freaking love them and once I do have them like where they're supposed to be sitting it's fine uh, so yeah they are super great um, I love them they look good with like a fancier top like this and then you can also uh, wear the knit sweater that I'm going to show you guys in a second or like a big baggy t-shirt which is my favorite way to wear them so yeah really 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 love these a lot so this is the knit sweater which I love so much um, like I was saying in the beginning it is pretty low cut I would not be comfortable going out in public like this but for the video it's gonna be fine just if I were going out I would wear like a bandeau or something underneath of it um, I really really love this it's like a big like sweater dress kind of deal and then it has these um, whole things on the shoulders which I love because you can see my Sylvanas tattoo perfectly and it's like framed her lovely and same with this side with my Elvish and my Even Star tattoo it's like it's just freaking perfect I love it so much this is definitely one of my favorite outfits ever um, and it looks super good with the leggings because of uh, where the sweater falls like it's kind of long and it goes like right to where the detailing of the fishnet starts so it looks super super cute it almost makes the leggings look like thigh highs in a way kind of um i really 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 like it so yeah um and it has this cute like o-ring in the middle too uh very neat and i have my choker on underneath because i'm not taking it off but uh this is also part of the sweater too so yep i am literally obsessed with this it's so cozy and it's like nice and baggy and i'm pretty sure that this is an extra small i'm gonna link all the sizes and stuff or like put them in the description so you guys know but I'm pretty sure that it's an extra small and it still fits like really baggy and comfy 
and I just adore it so much. So that is it for my Killstar portion of the haul, and now I'm just going to kind of show you um, the other things that are sort of unrelated. Um, so I have two tops, this being one of them that um, my fiancé got for me from Hot Topic, and he actually took me there like right after he proposed to me, so that was freaking amazing. Um, so they had t-shirts on, buy two, get one free, or something like that, so we got three shirts, um, I got two of them and he kept one, and they're all like Cat Reaper kind of themed ones, so I have this one first that has like a reaper guy with his like scythe and like kitties on it and stuff and it's freaking so cute. Um, I got it in a medium because I like big baggy t-shirts. Basically now my fiance and I can match because he has uh, a different cat reaper shirt but it's like the same type of idea and I freaking love it. I think his is like a reaper riding a cat or something like that. Uh, so this is the other one. So this one is just basically a cat uh, on a bunch of skulls and it says souls on it which is... Uh, really, really great. Uh, again, big baggy size medium shirt and I just am so, so in love. Um, I've been absolutely obsessed with these shirts and also, let me fix my choker. This has been like my favorite thing, wearing this choker with like these black shirts. I really, I don't know what it is, I just like how this like falls on the t-shirt. Sorry if I didn't fix it for the last one that I was wearing, but I just am obsessed. So this is like my ultimate like comfy kind of outfit but like still gothic emo style and everything. I adore it so much. Yeah, anyways, this is actually the last item that I have. I went through them pretty quickly. So I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. Sorry it was kind of like a mashup of like Killstar and other random stuff. I just felt like I didn't have enough Killstar stuff to make it like a proper video. So I was like, whatever, I'll just throw in some Hot Topic uh, alternative other clothing that I had. So. Um, if you have any questions about how the stuff fits me or like sizing anything or just whatever questions you have, let me know. Um, I typically weigh between 105 to 110 pounds depending on the day and I am 5 foot 2. Um, but yeah, anyways, I hope that you guys have a wonderful day and I will talk to you again soon. Bye guys!